Rising COVID-19 cases in Orange County. Today, the Orange County Health Agency revealed 304 new cases and two deaths. The county's positivity rate now stands at 3.3%. While the numbers are nowhere near LA County's figures, there is concern about the increase in cases of the Delta variant. That's right. Hospitals are admitting more COVID patients, and KCAL 9 Orange County reporter Michelle Geely went inside one local ER today to see how they're coping, and she joins us live. Michelle, it's almost like deja vu. Mm -hmm. That's right, and 95% of the cases, this is what the doctors inside are telling me, coming into the emergency department behind me here, that's Providence St. Joseph Hospital in Orange, 95% uh, of the COVID cases are people who are unvaccinated, and I did go inside to find out what could be behind the spike in cases. What we're seeing today over the last you know, couple of weeks is the result of gathering of unvaccinated patients probably around the 4th of July holiday. COVID cases in Orange County as well as hospitalizations are rising according to the health care agency. Here in the emergency room at St. Joseph Hospital in Orange, Dr. Brian Lee has noticed the change, something he attributes to the 4th of July two and a half weeks ago. Definitely transmissibility is between the highest risk people are unvaccinated uh, people who are not masking and uh, gathering together. Dr. Lee is calling it a minor spike in COVID cases. In June, fewer than 10 COVID patients were seen at St. Joseph Hospital compared to the last few weeks where the number has doubled to more than 20 people, many with contagious variants of the disease. Pneumonia and loss of oxygen, that comes later on, that comes in the second week. So typically around day eight, of illness is when we're seeing patients seeking care in the emergency room because they really can't breathe and they need supplemental oxygen. And that can last for anywhere from eight to 14 to 20 days. The doctor expects to see another jump around Labor Day and again in the winter when we see a surge in flu cases. COVID is, is another respiratory virus. So uh, with more and more people indoors and, and closer together, we can see uh, higher numbers. Now, the doctor told me that thousands of COVID variants have been discovered, but luckily, the, uh, the vaccines that we use here in the United States have been responsive to those major COVID variants. That's the latest live in Orange. I'm Michelle Geely. Back to you. Michelle, thank you.